Half ass off grid, back again. Here's the scoop. My wife and I found a bunch of black caps. So what black caps are, are the Idaho version of blackberries. Just as you can see, they're teeny. It takes a while to pick them. So, I got a box of pectin and the fun little recipe that takes five cups of black caps, seven cups of sugar. Yeah, seven cups of sugar. And a package of pectin. We're gonna boil it up and we're gonna can it. Got the canner rolling, got the lids done so they can just go on to just hang out. Um, not everybody does that. I've just found it makes the, the lids a little bit gummier. They seal a little bit better. Plus it sanitizes them because, I mean, they've been boiling for a while. So let's get to making the goo that's gonna turn into jam. Let's take a quick little break here before we get too carried away. I just wanted to show what these little guys look like. Um, this is where we got them, this is behind the cabin. And as you can see, they're just little teeny blackberries. I don't know if it's a different species just because they're wild. Um, I'm quite familiar with regular blackberries that are like the size of your thumb, but these aren't. I don't know if it's just so dry where we live or if it's just, like I said, if it's just a different species. But this year they were everywhere. And if we'd have got here a little sooner, we would have probably had twice as many, but we didn't. And it's cool, we got enough for our batch. Um, I don't know what we'd do with two batches of jam. Ouch. Well, these are a little bit more dangerous to pick than hex. They both do. They both do. I'm gonna go down to that bush down there. You want this? Well, I was gonna, I was just eyeing that one too because a lot of those are dried. You know, these are yeah, dried. Yeah, this is all dried up. You can see some of them are stuck on. They're like petrified and dried on. That's why I'm not picking them. Like I say, they're small, but what they lack in size, they definitely make up for in taste. They're phenomenal. They're a lot more sour than a regular blackberry. So here we go, five cups of black caps. We'll just let that sit upside down and we'll need the hand dandy potato masher and our pectin. So we're gonna give that a quick crush just to release some juice. And bring that up to low, then we will stir in the package of pectin. So we'll just keep using the potato masher because that's convenient. Make sure it's good and mixed in there. We just started heating it up. Let that heat up and cheat a moment and get it boiling. Getting closer. So a rolling boil is when it doesn't stop boiling when you stir it. 
then we'll have to do it for exactly a minute. All right, here we go. You can see it's not stopping. It's still boiling. Timer. On. Timer. One minute. On. Boil for a minute. Stirring constantly. By the way, no copyright intended. Just simply passing the time. We'll come back at the filling stage. All right. So now we fill these guys up. Supposed to leave about a quarter inch of head space, which is about the bottom of the funnel. Just muff that up. If you want everything to be nice and clean when you seal it. But making jam's just not clean. It's kind of like giving your six-year-old some Play-Doh. Or some other fun goo. My grandma could do this and not make a mess, but not me. My wife can do it and not make a mess. Not me. All right, everybody's loaded, and we will see you, my sweet little things, in 10 minutes. Well, here we go. Get these little guys out of here. Looking good so far. Kind of chunky, you can see. And that's good because I'm hoping that they set like a sun of them. Get a little teeny one out of there. Alright, we'll check and see if they seal back up. Of course they will. So, as you can see, everybody sealed up. They're just starting to set. Getting nice and gooey. God damn, they're still hot. But that'll be the seven pints and a little bit of leftovers. Nothing better than what nature provides. So thanks for watching. Hit the like and subscribe. Don't forget, find your balance. Here we are all labeled up, sealed up, and ready to go into the pantry. Till the next time, find your balance. Don't forget to like and subscribe.